Well, hey everybody, I'm on the back deck. The wind's blowing, but it's in a maybe stop state right now, but I want to say something real quick. There's this uh, little guy from Brazil that's been real good at making videos about the hidden truth behind the Anunnaki and the Nephilims. And um, it, his YouTube channel is under attack by YouTube itself. And so I want to put a link in the description box for you to find him. And there's videos right up here uh, that'll show up that um, I have made videos about his videos, like reviewing them. So I hope I didn't get him in trouble, but whatever it is, uh, his, his audience is not going to be so big no more because they demonetized him and shadow banned him and otherwise started censor censorship in him. In other words, giving him red strikes, saying he's misusing um, information when what he's doing is he's uh, creating uh, images with videos through those AI programs that allow him to do that with good images. Uh, I think I heard him say Mid Journey was one that he was paying for, and there's other ones. And I, his English is not his first language, so he, he's using an, an interpreter uh, AI type system that is, is helping him with his writing for English and checking it and grammar in it and all that. So I don't know if they're getting him for plagiarism, but whatever it is, he's on the spot and I want to help him. I want to um, keep making review videos about his videos. He's going to go to Rumble, and so as soon as I know the link to Rumble, I'll, I'll put it in the description box so you can find it. But the videos are just too good. You gotta, you gotta check it, check it out up here where you see uh, it, it pop up there. That's uh, a video that I got in the description box about his videos and about you know, I may highlight um, his top you know most popular videos I may do four four of them in the description so you'll get a feel for his YouTube channel he he's gonna need our help to keep keep this uh, teaching going so I'll keep this video short because of the wind and just tell you that when somebody like that gets uh, attacked, we all got to come to a creative understanding that we can help him. Hopefully they won't take his channel down, but if they do, I hope he backs up everything. I'm actually backing up his work just, just for historical purposes. It's so good. It's that damn good. I'm not going to repost this stuff in whole. I'm just going to have it up in a backup hard drive that's in a, like a Faraday cage. So for historical purposes, it'll be there when the grid goes down. And don't think the grid will ever not go down. That's the plan of the dark is to actually uh, time it with what is going to be an opportunist time for to say there is a, like a worldwide blackout. And that can come from uh, EMP pulse, it can come from artificial flash of the sun. They can tell us the sun uh, burped and, and caused a keratin event. Or they can time it with that actual blast of the codons of love and light that we've been expecting from the sun and the central sun of the Milky Way galaxy. We're deep into the photon belt right now. If you don't know what the photon belt is, look up photon belt Buddy Huggins and you'll see videos that I've been making on it for years. So something is, is in the works. If uh, you're listening to this, if, if he, um, in, like in this image right here, uh, work with uh, your county, city in your area so when it's time to have meetings everybody will be on the same page but if the internet goes down and the cell phones don't work go to the libraries in your cities every Saturday from 12 to 1 10 to 1 something like that you'll start meeting people that are going to give you intel and understanding and wisdom using uh, ham radios 
with uh, the new technology called Skip. So that's all that's in the works, and we got to be prepared for it not to happen. Because best case scenario is it never happens. Worst case scenario it happens next week, and everybody ain't ready for it. But right here in Ozark, Missouri, if it does happen, come to the OC. They are, based on what I've been told by the commissioners and uh, city officials, they're going to uh, be open for that on the outside and a pavilion. And the back has a pavilion here in the back. But if it, uh, yeah, if we can't meet there, then we'll find other places to meet. But for emergency situations, uh, come to the OC in this community. In other communities, go to your local library. All right? Educate yourself on what happens when uh, the system goes down. The whole system. I'm not talking about pieces. I'm talking about the whole system. You need to have cash money on hand, things to barter and trade, and make sure you got plenty of water. It takes a lot of water to survive for two, three months. Just do the math calculation on it. The uh, Church of Latter-day Saints has a calculator for that. And food. You'd be shocked at how much food they tell you you got to have, which is bull crap. I eat one time a day. I eat very little food. Some people say I eat a lot of sugar. <laughs> but I can handle some cookies from McDonald's, I can tell you that. Yeah, there's just the right amount of cookies. I mean, you don't eat don't eat nothing else, but just, you know, hey, a meal ain't complete until you got a sweet. That's, but I'm going fast on them for about a week. I do that. I eat them for a while, and then I take a whole week, Monday to Monday off. And sometimes it works, sometimes it don't. But uh, y'all keep watching my channel. I uh, Thank you. I'll be on top of the construction going on on Riverside Bridge. I sent uh, the information to Google about both bridges. Uh, the Green Bridge is closed and Riverside Bridge will be closed to traffic except for one lane. One lane. And that's supposedly, based on the paperwork I got, they had 120 days to finish this job and it's supposed to be done March the 9th. They ain't even started. And we're expecting heavy rain in the next four or five days after tomorrow. So that'd be right in the time they're trying to do construction. It ain't a good thing, but I will report on it and I will tell you the truth. I will never mislead you or lead you astray. If I tell you I don't know, it's cause I don't know. But if I tell you I know, I can't tell you, it's cause somebody might try to kill me. <laughs> so I have to keep some intel to myself. Y'all have a good day. Love you. Keep coming back to my channel. Thank you.